You want to use your phone a friend lifeline? Okay. Let's get them on the line now, but you don't have to take the answer they give. Debbie here. Hello. Hello, Debbie. This is Chris Tarrant from Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Hello, Chris. Right, we're into some really serious money now. Your friend is completely stuck. Hopefully you can get them through it. It's worth, no pressure, £64,000. You can count on me, Chris. Now, I hope you're ready for this. Here comes the question, Debbie. I'm not completely certain, but I think Dunkley Beacon is on Exmoor. It's a bit of a guess, really, but something says Exmoor to me. Debbie, that's great. Thanks for that. Well, it's decision time for you now. Do you go along with Debbie's choice of A, or maybe you have an alternative answer? Right, let's try and help by narrowing the choice down for you. Computer, take away two wrong answers, please, leaving just the right answer and the one remaining wrong answer. Well, that's left you with A or B to choose from. OK, right, this is your lifeline. You've made a choice to ask the audience. Audience, if you would, please, put your fingers on your keypads. Let's try and help out. Or vote now. Yes, not much difference of opinion there. So you're saying it's A. Are you confident? You had nothing to lose by playing this question. And you haven't! You've just won £64,000! Now you're getting into really serious money territory. The next question is worth £125,000 and you are just four away from a million. Take your time, you don't have to play it, but here it comes. Which comedian wrote and starred in the TV comedy Happiness? Dylan Moran. Alan Davis, Sean Hughes, Paul Whitehouse. You're going for D. Oh, you were doing so well. But now you've done even better. You've just won 125 thousand pounds you have 125,000 pounds now you now have question 13 of 15 coming up take your time it's worth 250,000 pounds if you can give me the right answer good luck here it comes The roundel is an emblem identifying which branch of the forces? Royal Navy, Royal Air Force, Army, Territorial Army. So you're saying B. You had a hundred and twenty five thousand pounds in your hand. You didn't have to play that last question. You could have walked away. You did play it. You've no longer got a hundred and twenty five thousand pounds. 
you've now got a quarter of a million pounds. Right, here we go. This next question is worth £500,000. Half a million. Have a look. This is question number 14 of 15. It's worth £500,000. Take as long as you need. Here it comes. Which British classic horse race is run latest in the year? St Ledger. Oaks, 1,000 guineas, 2,000 guineas. So you think it's A? You had a quarter of a million pounds. You didn't have to play this question. You decided you would. If you're wrong, you lose 218,000 pounds of that money. You're not wrong. You've just won half a million pounds. Amazing, 500,000 quid. Well, you're doing brilliantly, fantastic, half a million pounds. Now, there's a cheque waiting here with your name on it for 500,000 pounds. But we don't want to give you that. We'd love to give you the next one, the big one. You are just one right answer away from a million pounds. Now, have a look at it. At this moment, you can leave here quite happily with 500,000 pounds. But the next question, the final question, is worth one million pounds. This is it. Which instrument was originally called a symphonium? Concertina. Accordion. Mouth organ. Banjo. So you think it's A? You just risked £468,000 by going for that answer. It was a risk, and you knew it was a risk. But it was a risk worth taking. You have just won a million pounds. You've done it. Fantastic. Congratulations. You are a millionaire on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Thanks. Here we go again with Who Wants to Be a Millionaire?